Hey guys, we are back and we're going after some more fall crappie. We caught a pretty good mess of them last round and we're going to try it again. We're going to be using them 10 footers with jigs and minnows, some five foot sixes with jigs and minnows closer to the front of the boat and a long 13 foot jig pole dragging out the back of the boat with a jig and minnow. And I'll be slinging the old beetle spin, Bobby Garland jig and live minnow and cast them to the structure. See if any of these fish are transitioning from the middle to the shallows. Anyway, I don't know if that's going to happen or not because it has warmed back up again, but hopefully it'll happen. We'll find a good mess of them. Let's go get them. There he is. Oh, that's good crap. Easy. Easy. He is mad about it. How about it there, guy? Nice, pretty black crappie. Man, these things are getting thick, guys. They get, get, they're getting ready. Loving in the quarter. Loving in the quarter, black crappie. I like it. We'll take it. Well, guys, we're set up. We got our 10 footers on the side with jigs and minnows. We got these five foot sixes with jigs and minnows. And we got the old uh, 13 footer out the back of the boat with the jig and a minnow. And then, of course, right here I'm using for casting in, in the deep and shallow and around the structures. I'm just using this old beetle spin. It's a customized beetle spin. Put a gold perforated blade on there and a Bobby Garland jig. That color of that jig right there is called Lights Out. It's a pretty good color. They like it. Got a red painted jig hood. This is a 16th ounce. It's beat up pretty good, but it's still working. And I got a live minnow on there. And if he's not live, don't worry. If he's not too lively, this old beetle spin will swim him around and make him lively for you. You just cast her out there. And I don't run it steady. I just kind of let it sink for about three to five seconds. And then I pull up and let her go back down. Pull up and let her go back down. Just slow fish it, just like you would a jig or something, like a double jig rig. And that's how I catch these old crappie on this old beetle spin. They like it. But I'll catch them trolling around too, guys. This is a good way to catch some extra fish. So that's one way to fill that stringer. There he goes. Got him. Easy. Oh, I lost him. <laughs> he was a good fighter. He got off. Well, guys, I like to take some super glue gel and glue these jigs. They last so much longer. You get your money's worth. These are Bobby Garland jigs. The color is lights out. And I just take a put a little super glue right there at the, the tail of the head and squeeze that up on there and set it down and get me another one i make me several of them so all i got to do is just kind of change them and i don't have i can change colors too if i need to if i bend a hook or something but uh i'll make red ones and and pink ones and i got some greens and pearl whites and just get me a bunch of them make them up and then they last a really long time you don't have to do all that extra work trying to keep them on your jig hook and all that just a little bit of glue on each side now the regular super glue is too liquidy for me i make a mess i make a mess anyhow but if i just put a little bit of gel on there i can usually pop them on there and just let them sit there right there for a few minutes and then i'll start using them and i'll put the extra ones in a, in my box you see i have some other ones made up of different colors but anyway that's what i like to do guys it saves me so much time and saves me money There he goes. Oh yeah. That feels like a pretty good one. If we can get him in. Yeah, maybe. Oh yeah. Not bad. Black crappie. Let's see what he is. Oh yeah, he's ten and a half. 
he's big enough for me. We'll take him. There he goes. There he is. Yeah, we got some crappy. He looks big enough. So far, it's been mostly black crappie so far. Yeah, he's a 10 and a quarter. Pretty thick black crappie. We'll take him. Get him over the log. Oh, I lost him. I knew it. I wasn't going to get him across that log. But wow, that was a quick bite. I'm going to see if there's any more in there. Oh, I would have loved to get him across the log. I was pretty sure he's a crappie. He knew what he was doing. Went straight for that log. Try it again. Might be another one in there. Yeah, that was pretty. Oh, there he is. All right, we got a good something. What is that? That's, that one's a bass, I'm pretty sure. Oh, yeah. Nice bass. That's a good bass right there. Chunky, he's, he's been eating pretty good. <laughs> Look at that belly. Nice and fat, thick old bass. There he goes. Oh yeah, if I can get him in. Uh oh, we got another bite behind us, but Try to get this one in first. Yeah, he's a that's a white crop. You see, step back out there for a minute. We got us a white crop, and he was right in the middle, a little over 11. We'll take it. There he is. I got one trolling. Let's see what he is. Oh, he's a crappie. If I can get him all the way in. <laughs> I was going to another location and just dragged the old beetle spin. Yeah. White crappie. Get this old hook on him. There we go. Let's see how long he is. He's 11 and a quarter, and he about flipped out of the boat. <laughs> we got you. We'll take him. about a nice fall crappie that's a black crappie look how thick he is solid mm-hmm <laughs> yes sir I guess we'll give him a length check right here wow that dude is right there a little over 12 and three quarters yes sir that's a good fall crappie We'll take him. There 
There he goes. He's a little guy. Let's still give him a uh, way in here. Not a way in, but a measure. <laughs> he's hungry too. <laughs> but he's seed. Seed for the future. Yeah. He's like eight and three quarters. Little bitty guy. White crappie. Too late. That's a nice one. Easy, baby. Come on in here. White crappie. Oh, yeah, we got another good one. Oh, there we go. That's a pretty one. Pretty thick white crappie there. Let's see what he is. He's 12. That's a good one. We'll take it. That's a pretty good one. <laughs> yes, sir. These guys are getting thicker, guys. Getting ready for that cold weather, I guess. Eleven and a quarter. Eleven and a quarter black crappie. Well, taking. This used to be a pretty good hot spot, though. Sometimes it is, sometimes it ain't. Oh, there, there's a couple bait, baits up there, so. Surely there's a crappie that's hungry. We just need one hungry crappie. I'll take two, but if we just get one more, I'll be happy. There you go. I think that's him. Easy, buddy. Well, is that a crappie or a bass? He shook like a bass. He's a crappie. Alrighty. That's a good one. Oh, yeah. Black crappie. Pretty good size one. Good eating size. Yes, sir. He may be my last one. I will. I got one more minute to try. But uh, he's right there at 11 inches. 11 inch black crappie, man, they are pretty. We'll take it. He's a pretty one, and he's a good thick one. We'll take it. 